One type of twitching is there's a starvation and the body's trying to self-regulate, okay? The other type is the chi, remember the chi pulls the blood. And this is the medicine of analogy. It doesn't really work this way. It works in something much more wonderful, mysterious, okay? But we have to have our analogies. So chi pulls the blood, but the blood is having trouble for stasis. So the chi gets through and doesn't pull the blood. And that's the twitches where the people are uncontrollable. You see this a lot in people who do qigong, right? And then they think they're getting rid of blockages. I've got to be very honest. If you're doing your qigong and this is going on and you got rid of the blockage, it shouldn't happen again because you got rid of the blockage. But if it's in your practice all the time, you have to ask yourself two things. One, why do I always have a blockage? Or two, huh? <laughs> right? You got to put a question mark in there and challenge yourself to be like, mm, maybe actually there's something wrong in my practice. And usually it's posture locking blood flow so the chi gets through because we're so quiet and calm. Heart rate goes way down. Chi flows. Blood can't go with it. Right? So it's kind of like your car jumping because the gas isn't getting through. Right? That's not a good sign. Uh, if you go, oh, ah, and the rest of your practice is wonderful and it never happens again, yay. But if this is you all the time, consider the alternative that maybe that's not something to cultivate. 